Yo, what is going on you guys? It's TL13 here, aka the Lucky 13, bringing you guys some more Call of Duty World War II content. And today is kind of an all over the place video because I recorded some Domination gameplay recently in hopes of talking about either Domination 75 or Domination XL. And there's going to be more of like a live stream kind of thing. I'm going to try not to make any cuts. Just let this all play out. The video is going to be about 10 minutes, a little past that, assuming I watch the whole gameplay for you guys. So I'm playing USS Texas, regular Domination. It's not 75, it's not XL. And the main thing I wanted to talk about was Sledgehammer made this tweet recently. And this tweet is a poll, obviously, and it's, what do you prefer, Dom 50, Dom 75, Dom 100. So Dom 100 obviously means XL, Domination 50 just means the regular Domination which you're seeing in the gameplay. And Dom 75 is what we had last time for the double XP like weekend they like to do, which was 75 score per kill. So all those refer to how much score you get per kill without a defend or offensive metal. Has nothing to do with how much score you get for the flag. Has nothing to do with different time limits, score limits. It's just how much score you get per kill, which also refers to how much uh, XP you get per kill, which is clearly a big thing. So, the reason they've released these things is because people have either complained or they're understanding that regular domination doesn't give you the score per minute. Like, they probably go through, like, the player base. Like, how many people are playing domination, like, normally? How many people are playing other game modes normally? Because right now, in Team Deathmatch, you get, like, double the score per minute, I'd assume, with, like, the same level of play so if you're spawn trapping a domination yeah you might get more score per minute than you get in tdm but it's like i would rather be playing hard point over domination without a problem like i get double the xp double the score in hard point so why would i be playing domination and it sucks because i actually really like domination like in older games i didn't play it all that much because i found that's where all like the sweats were but nowadays it's like domination isn't just super sweaty or anything because the score per minute's not there anyway like the sweats are in hard point so i played some domination today and it was pretty decent um i do get a really good like a solid amount of score in the game like i do well but like my score per minute is low. It's like 300 something. And normally my score per minute in like good game modes would be like 500. So it's like, why are people playing domination? So in hopes that that uh, poll would reach Dom 75 or Dom XL, I assume because like they said, they wanted it to end uh, today, April 13th at 10 a.m. PDT, which is when they do all like their operation updates, their weekend updates, everything like that, which is 1 p.m. my time, Eastern, uh, Eastern time, I think. Uh, I'm really bad with time zones. I just assume I know what's up. So that's like, I assume it was just going to be a weekend thing because they wanted the poll to end Friday, like right before they would launch a weekend update. But instead today, when the poll ends, it's 81%. Here's the screenshot of the end poll. I think 81% um for domination xl so clearly everyone wants domination xl like that's it so i'm thinking okay because they edited it friday like right when they do updates it'll probably drop just for the weekend with double xp and whatever just like it did uh last weekend or whatever weekend it was and uh, every weekend they try to do some double xp big thing to like keep people interested so fine it makes sense i'm happy with that another weekend of it at least that at least means we're gonna get it like consistently on weekends and whatever and the weekend update drops, and here's a screenshot of the tweet they just posted. So it's around like 10 minutes later now, and I don't really understand why they wanted the poll to end then. So it's almost getting my hopes up and almost not telling me anything because like you would assume that them doing that means we're getting it like this weekend and then we don't get it this weekend so it's like can i then get my hopes up that they just wanted it at this time so they can implement it in like the back data of the game like not giving it to us but putting it in the info in the game to be ready to launch permanently or just to be ready to launch again next weekend or something. So it's really something I'm wondering about. Uh, the war thing is great. Like it's it's double XP war and pretty much like everything. I think it's like, maybe it's, I don't know. It's like triple, double, double on their uh, their tweet. So I didn't really understand that. Oh, I get it. It's uh, two times XP for each thing, soldier division and uh, weapons. So, okay, that makes more sense now that I think about it. So if you guys play a lot of war, you're, you are getting rewarded. You get the, uh, the mosh pit one if you have the resistance DLC, which I don't because I didn't really care enough for the maps. I'm not going to pay for something I don't care about. And a YouTuber I watched pointed it out that if you don't get them, you get worse players because it's like the crappy, I don't know, level 10s that barely play aren't going to invest in a map pack, right? So like you can get those lobbies and whatever so like you can see at halftime i have 1860 score which is not that much considering it's been like five minutes of playing so 
If the score minute isn't there, we need 75, we need XL, like, I actually play those game modes, and I like domination, like I said, but I'm not gonna play if I'm not getting the score per minute I need, like, if I'm trying to grind these leaderboards, I'm not getting anywhere with this. So, hopefully, like, really, really hopefully, they're doing Dom XL again because because Dom XL did get the most votes. They they have to include that somewhere. They're not just asking; cause they're curious. Like they're they're putting it somewhere. So we should see Domination XL before we see Dom seventy five again. And I'm hoping it's permanently. But if it is just next weekend, um, thinking about it, I don't think I'm doing much next weekend. Just regular stuff. So I'll be like home the same amount of time I normally am on the weekends. Like not any more free than normal. Not any busier than normal. So. Next weekend, hopefully, if they do drop it just then, I will get the double XP, I'll play it, I'll grind it, like, it's whatever. But I really would love if they could include it as a full game mode. So when they tested Dom 75 for the weekend, I'm like, okay, why? Because we had Dom XL, we had played regular Domination, why would they give us 75, like, kind of out of nowhere? So my theory was they were testing it to see if it was enough score to get people playing, but not too much that it overpowers and makes people not want to play it. Like, people that are, like, fearing score streaks and stuff, as if they didn't already release requisitions, which made score streaks annoying regardless of anything. So it, it really made me think they're testing 75 if it's not, like too overpowered and it's a healthy medium then 75 was here to stay but of course 75 was gone on after the weekend as well like normal at monday 10 a.m pdt so clearly they it was gone like that maybe they were thinking about it and then they released this poll where you voted and i'm like okay well clearly everyone's gonna vote xl that's what we want and so maybe it was for a full release because now you want us to vote but if we're voting like why did the vote end and why are we waiting still so maybe they'll drop it completely maybe they'll only drop it for the weekend like normal i'm like stressing myself trying to figure it out and because of the time they ended it it makes the most sense for them to be releasing it for the weekend but then they didn't so i'm thinking it is in the back data of the game like uh the code of the game i guess i don't know enough technical terms or whatever so i'm thinking it's inside of the game we just don't have access yet so if it is like that though, when would they release it? I'm thinking maybe Monday when this whole double XP war thing ends, we get it Monday and it's permanently in the game again. But like, this is all my speculation, my opinion. I have no idea. I don't talk to anyone that like has this information at all. So <clears throat> also right here, I'm like stressing for my life with the SMG and I just reloaded and then I had no bullets and I'm like, what is going on? Like I'm streaking here. So whole mess of gameplay right here uh just slaying these kids in their own spawn though uh honestly stg still like the best gun uh as long as the pbsh of course but very different guns so if you guys think they will drop it let me know i really don't think they would drop it permanently like just my opinion i don't think it's something they would do but it's quite possible they will so if you guys think they'll like drop it permanently let me know i think it'll just be a weekend thing again i think it'll be next weekend probably and that'll be that and i don't mind it a lot like shipment 1944 we had and i thought it was gonna like leave so i was like grinding it enjoying it loving it and then when i realized you know what this thing is here to stay i'm like this isn't that much fun anymore <laughs> like it was it was fun grinding like you gained so many levels so much xp at one time and i grinded that and then i realized it was here to stay and i'm like well if I can just grind this whenever, I'm not going to only play this to grind. Like, I, I can just play again. Like, I'll play this when I really want to grind. But if it's here to stay, it's it's not a big deal. So maybe Dom75 or Dom XL, whatever they release, which should be XL due to the pull. Maybe I won't care that much once it's finally released. It's like, you, you realize how much you like something when it's gone, right? So it's like, it comes and goes. And so you love it so much because it's exclusive. But when you've played it every single day for like... We'll say, we'll keep it small, like a week, two weeks, three weeks. You're like, I've done this. I am I want something new again. So if they only bring it in on weekends, they know the players will be on on the weekend. So it's really like this whole thing. You have to really get into like the uh, psychology of the situation. Um, you, you need to understand like business standpoint, like what's best for them. Because if they just put it out for, for good, everyone will be like on it, all about it. And then like later, like will the player base drop off of it? Will people care? What can they release on weekends then to get more people into it? Like just do double XP for that. Like it, it's a really big thing that you have to kind of like understand that you, you won't know. So 
that's my whole opinion. I really would love for it to at least be next weekend. And if it does come out only on weekends, make sure it's double XP because that'll ensure people are on it. So that was the gameplay. Uh, maybe I'm going to press whatever the button is, select so I can see how I finish because I honestly forget. Oh, 40 and 16. I went 40 and 16 and I had great, like, it was a good gameplay. It was playing objective and didn't, the score of pennant wasn't there. So that's my whole rant of the day. That's my whole uh, covering of the topic. So let me know if you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what videos you want to see next from the new update. Uh, Leave a comment down below. And if you enjoyed it, check my Twitter below if you guys want to keep up with my grind and everything. But without further ado, I am signing off. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been TL13. Peace out.